Welcome to Style Masterclass, the podcast that teaches women to look stylish and feel confident so that they can show up ready to conquer and slay no matter what size they are. I'm your host, Miss J. You ready? Hello, welcome back to the Style Masterclass podcast. This is a live recording. You can catch it on the YouTube live. Make sure you hit subscribe so you don't miss any of the episodes, or you can hit subscribe to wherever you get your podcasts. I'm your host, Judith Katan. I am going to invite you into a virtual holiday soiree, and this soiree is going to last approximately a month from the time of Thanksgiving in the United States all the way through to Christmas. I am so excited to bring these episodes to you. And I think they're really fun. I did this a few years ago, and it really was just a way of getting everyone in the holiday spirit, bringing you a little bit of joy, some encouragement, and of course, as always, practical style tips, practical mindset tips so that you can navigate the holiday season. I know a lot of my clients start to feel a little squirrely around this time of year. So I wanted to create a new series of holiday soiree episodes so that we could ease you in, give you some holiday cheer, and then help you navigate all the relationship and weird things that sort of come up for people during this time of year. I actually want to make this more a little style heavy this time around. So these holiday soirees are going to have some really practical style tips, things that you can implement on your own to bring a little bit of that holiday cheer into your wardrobe, as well as mindset tips for navigating funny things that happen during holiday season with family, with yourself, etc. So let's dive into the first episode. I want to set the tone. I want you to imagine you are coming into a room and there are a ton of other amazing lady bosses like yourself gathered. We are having delicious food. I've cooked a huge pot of Puerto Rican rice, arroz con candules, and everyone's eating and there's music. And if you're into drinking, then we have some coquito, which is a customary holiday drink for Puerto Ricans. And there's also apple cider that's sparkling (laughs) and whatever your pleasure. Welcome, welcome to the soiree. You 100% belong here. Whatever your size, your weight, or your shape, you don't have to scan this room to see where you measure up and if you belong. At this party in this room, you are 100% allowed to take up all the space. Those of you who are introverts, you are welcome. We're here to love on you. For those of you who are extroverts, you are not too much in this crowd. You are perfect. You are worthy. You are valuable. And we are so, so glad you're here. This is a kind of community and connection I want to create for all of my clients. And since we're doing this virtually, it's more important than ever that we set the tone. Here's the practical mindset tip I want to give you. As you enter rooms, in real life rooms or Zoom rooms this holiday season, if you identify as an introvert or an extrovert, what I want you to pay attention to is the human penchant for scanning the room to see where we measure up on some invisible unknown hierarchy, which is of our own creation, and then deciding whether we're allowed to be ourselves in this particular room. Before you enter that room, I want you to decide for yourself. You have value, you are worthy, you are lovable, you are beautiful, and the usual desire to measure yourself against the rest of the people in the room. We can expect that because you're a human being and you're having a human experience. But then we can also reframe that as, okay, this is just something people do, but there is no hierarchy. There is no the most beautiful woman in the room, the thinnest woman in the room, the one who makes the most money, the one who has the most important job, the one who's doing the most. I'm not good enough by comparison is typically what happens. And our desire to pick people out of a lineup, categorize them, this is normal human heuristics. We have to overcome that (laughs) lower part of our brain with the front part of our brain thinking, our higher brain. Reminding our brain that hierarchies and categorizations are things of our own making. There is no doing the best job, doing the most, doing it better. There's just 
humans who are gathered in a room, all with their own sets of struggles, their own concerns, their own worries, their own doubts, their own fears, their own pleasures, their own joys, their own places where they find contentment. You're going to enter the room as an equal. So I want you to imagine you're pulling up to my soiree. You take a big, deep breath before you open that door. And you remind yourself lovingly, gently, you belong in the room. You belong in the room where it happens. You are a magic bringer of your own. You have value. You have worth. You are beautiful. Your presence in and of itself is desired. It's needed. It's wanted. This is going to take some practice. And some of you (laughs) might need to listen to this episode a few times. In fact, I recommend you favorite this episode right now so that you have it to play back to yourself before you enter a Zoom room or an in real life room this holiday season. This is my love note to you, something that you can play back to yourself for that needed boost of encouragement or confidence. You are entering the room as an equal. How would you like to contribute? What would you like to offer? You can decide all of this ahead of time and then find your natural segue. If you're an extrovert, (laughs) this is doubly important. Sometimes we worry after the fact. (laughs) It's not entering the room, it's the problem. It's the after part. Again, I still want you to play that little recording that I just gave to yourself after you've left the room. And here's what I want you to know. Everything you said was perfect. It was just fine. You know how I know? Because you've already gone and said it. There's no need to ruminate that if you messed up or you spoke too much or you talked too much about yourself or were you a conversational greedy butt? (laughs) No. Everything you said, the amount of talking you did, all of it, it was perfect and it's done now. No need to ruminate when you go home. No need to ask your significant other, did I do okay? You did just fine, my friend. Give yourself the pleasure of just having had a good night where you were yourself. You're now officially off the hook. You have permission (laughs) to go offline for a little while without the rumination. It's not required. Now, those are the mindset things I want you to walk into that room with. Here's the style stuff. I want you to put paired things together that are seemingly opposite. So we're going to start with our first pair. And over the next few weeks, I'll give you some more style prompts. But for this first one, I want you to put something together that's chic and cozy. Oftentimes, when we think of something as chic, we think we have to be uncomfortable, and chic requires sacrifice in the form of girdles and spanks and really tight bras. What if none of that was required? And instead, you picked items that you're like, this is so chic. I feel so good when I wear this. And you paired it with something that was cozy. So maybe we're going to bust out our favorite jewelry pieces, do our makeup to the nines, and wear our comfiest joggers ever. Maybe we're going to rock our favorite foofy gown, bust out that sequence and that little bit of glitz and glam and sparkle, while also wearing our favorite pair of sneakers. I really want you to play with this. Chic and cozy. Seemingly opposite, but when we pair them together, their oppositeness, (laughs) the juxtaposition of the two, the place in the middle, that's the thing we are aiming for. So play with this a bit. See what you come up with. Welcome to the first day of our holiday soiree. Stay tuned for more. And if you know someone who would benefit from listening to this episode, share this episode wherever you can with whomever you can. Until next time, Miss J out. Thank you for listening to today's episode. To learn more about how to work with me, go to judithgatton.com. Click on the Start Here button to get access to my free personal style class. I give you a quick style win, a confidence boost, and you walk away with the tools to start getting stylish. Who doesn't love that? See you there. Miss J out.